Hey guys, so today we are doing the Silhouette Alta 3D printer unboxing. So before we start unboxing, I wanted to talk about what a 3D printer does. So a 3D printer allows you to print three-dimensional objects from the bottom up. It melts down the plastic filament that you load your machine with and it'll slowly start to assemble your design you know from the bottom up and you specify it in the software that you're using like the measurements and everything and the cool thing about the silhouette Alta is that you can use your 2d designs from the design store um, basically anything you want and you can make it into a 3d object so if you do not know how to design 3D objects, you can start there, which is really great for any newbie to 3D printing. So I hope you guys enjoy this video and stay tuned to the end where I'll be doing a test print for you. So this is what the Silhouette Alta box looks like. It came just as is. The shipping label is just on the other side. There were no other outer packaging. It's a pretty big box but it's actually pretty lightweight. So I'm just going to start opening it up. So all of the accessories that you see here are included with your machine. We have some platform tape sheets. They're like masking tape. Um, it also comes with the platform, of course. Some filament spool. Uh, this is the filament spool holder. Um, a cool fact about this is that this exact one was made using your 3D printer. Um, it has a power cable and some little tools and accessories for adjusting your machines. It has two different sizes of hex keys, a nozzle cleaner tool, a spatula tool, and some keys to lock and unlock the case. And also be sure to not lose the little straw. This is to feed your filament through so that it doesn't get tangled. And we just have some more cords. I think it comes with a European cord and a US cord. Which and now I'm taking out the 3D printer from the box. It was really light to take out. It's not heavy at all. And it comes packaged really nicely. It has all these foam pieces in the middle to protect all the important parts. Um, it's locked and I'm just using the keys that it came with to unlock it. The case is actually plastic. Um, it's not glass. I think that's why it's so light as well. So here are a close-up of the accessories that's included in the box. And here is a close-up of the 3D printer. Now this is my first time setting it up and I'm just going to walk you through on how I did it. So you're going to want to register your machine, um, go to silhouetteamerica.com slash setup and it's going to have instructions step by step on how to do it. And then we're just going to download the 3D software. And when you register and download the software, you'll also get some free uh, 3D designs. So when you first open up your software, it'll tell you how to remove the packaging and how to set it up. So this is me removing the packaging, trying to be as careful as I can to not touch um, the little parts of the machine. And then I am just quickly uh, setting up the wires, plugging in the power cables, 
using the US power cable since I am in the US and then I'm just using the USB wire so that I can connect it to my computer and now this is the platform with the platform tape and you put this at the base of your printer and you really have to push down kind of hard until it clicks and then to load the filament you are just going to turn on your machine and be sure to connect it to your computer and then you're going to go to the 3D print tab and then click on the spool and then load filament and it'll walk you through on how to do that as well so you're just going to put it through the the filament through the eyelid and then through the straw and then you're going to push this uh, clip and kinda just feed your filament until it goes into the machine's straw yeah, pause it. and then you click load filament and it will start printing so here it's heating up and loading the filament into the machine and it'll do like a little test print at first and it does this every time that you load a new filament which is good because if you're changing colors you want to get rid of the um, the old filament that's still in that part of the machine so that's what it's doing right now and now we're just going to go to the design section of the software and choose one of the free designs I'm using this heart paper clip and there's three modes that you can use there's draft standard and high quality uh, I'm using draft version just to make it quick and I'm just going to click print and it's just going to start printing so the way that a 3d printer works is that it melts the filament the filament is kind of like a plastic and it heats it up and it just prints your uh, project in layers so that's what it's doing right now so the bigger the project the longer it'll take this paper clip took about six minutes and the cool thing about the printer it tells you you know how long the project will take so there it is in action printing and after it's finished you want to wait a few minutes so that it can cool down and then you're just going to want to get your platform I mean your spatula that was included in the box and just kind of scrape it off of the platform and then you're just gonna want to clean up the edges a little bit this was in draft mode so you know it printed really quickly but there we go that's our 3d printed paper clip so it's you know plastic heart-shaped paper clip and that's our first 3D print using the Silhouette Alta. If you guys would like to learn more about the Silhouette Alta, you can check out their website. I'll link it down below. So thanks for watching and please subscribe and I'll talk to you guys soon.